is I had a guided spirit and she gave me a magical stone that can read every living thing's mind and look through their memories. The guided spirit told me that the stone had a cursed spell that would damage my brain once I used more than three times. To use the stone, I have to put the stone in my bare hands and keep focusing my mind toward the target person. Hence, what will I do for this stone? Use the stone to rebuild back a friendship. I have a friend once. We both are great brothers, best friend when we are still naughty children in kindergarten. We both separate and didn't contact with each other lesser and lesser when the two of us have start to have our own class in two different primary schools. We can't contact to each other because during that time we don't have any mobile device and we even didn't know where each other home address. But luckily, after five to six years, I met him back when I have entered Form 1 at my secondary school. We both are in the same class, but he looks strange. He tried to aware of me when I tried to communicate with him. He always shows his cold eyes that full of hatred when we met. I felt a bit unfortunately for losing a buddy without knowing the actual reason. I hope that I can use the magical stones of mine to, to read his mind and realize why is the reason for him to take those abandoned actions toward me. Then I will read my pet dog Edmund Mines. Edmund is a pulmonarian. The reason that I read his mind is because I want to know what he really wants from me. As a master of him, I really don't understand what he really wants. He yelled at me sometimes without any reason. For example, I stand up from a sofa, he yells. I pass by him, he yells. I want to know what he really wants, such as extra carry, foods and drinks, or other reasons. Lastly, I will use the magical stone to read back my guided spirit mind. I want to know why she gave me a magical stone without telling me why. Why she will be my guided spirit. After knowing the answer of all that I want, I will put the magical stone into one of the mountains in my country. This is the end of my story.